So now I'm going to show you how to animate certain objects using our custom animation feature. Now, right now we have our cafe scene and we have some ceiling fans. Right now the ceiling fans are just just there. They're just kind of stagnant. So we want to animate them to give it a little bit more, more life to our project. So I'm going to select my fan and go to scene control, create custom animation and then create animation. When I do that, an axis will come right about the middle of the object. It's this yellow arrow connected to this white ball. And we're gonna rotate that axis down so that it spins properly. Whatever direction this arrow is pointing is the center point of the rotation. So I'm gonna select move axis and rotate. Now I can rotate with this gizmo or I can rotate using the direct input and that's what I'm gonna do and just go zero and now it's pointing straight down and we can move this down to there and now it's gonna rotate around that axis and I'll hit finish because I like that now I'm gonna select the spinner and this is gonna create a rather large bounding box because it's encompassing the entire thing. But we don't want the entire thing to spin, we just want the fan blades to spin. So I'm gonna move this down to right about there. And then I'm gonna scale it because it's rather large. So scale and as you can see everything in green is going to be animated. everything in gray is not going to be animated. Oop. So I'm going to move this down a little bit and you'll see certain areas disappear and that looks about right. So once you get the selection that you like, finish and now that part is going to be animated. In order to preview that and it spins and we can change the direct I mean the the spin speed and get it faster or we can turn it down to a nice slow speed but I think uh, that speed looks good I like that speed so once I hit apply now that's propagated to all the instances of this family so each one of these fans can now animate just by simply right clicking right click right click and I think I got one more over here yep and so now all my fans are animating another nice feature is that all these fans are animated at the same speed now if I want them at different speeds I simply select the one I want to change a different speed and maybe I want this one to go a little bit faster so well that's a little too fast back it off and I want this one to go a little bit slower And now you can see there's different speeds. Same fan, same family, different animated speeds.